All right, the roof's been painted. Good. Now there is one last thing. There's a duffel bag in a locker on the second floor. I'd like you to bring it to me. Since you'll probably open it, there's no point trying to hide the fact that there's $24.7 million inside it. One third of it is yours, if you can bring it back. Why doesn't Edward get it? Uh, there are too many biters there. I can't risk losing him. We'd be completely defenseless. And this money's yours? Most of the bank's depositors are no longer human. Stealing from them isn't a crime. Why have you never once taken the wallet of a biter that you've beaten to death? Okay, I'll recover the bag, but there's no calling in the evac until I say so. When I bring back the money, I'm taking the radio. That is unacceptable. Yeah, but you'll accept it anyway, because you have no choice. You're worse than cream. Very well. I accept your terms.
Empty, of course. said I was a fool to trust you. It's not what you think. I would have taken you with me. I contacted the evac when you were off getting the paint. I had to tell who would be on board, so I gave them your name. Now, I don't know who you are, but they knew, and they said you were a no-go. So I had to send you on that phony money run. There is no money, at least none worth mentioning. I'm sorry, Crane, but I've got to get my family out of here. Go to the rooftop, and you'll find some things you can use. It's not what I promised, but it's the best I can do. Thank you for what you did for us, Crane. Good luck. Crane, how's your day been? Yeah, I thought we had an understanding. I think we have a better understanding now. But if you want to shoot me... Another time, maybe. He did leave you a few goodies. I was going to nick them, but I thought, no, Crane's earned them. Let him have them. Well, you're almost okay, Kareem. <laughs> almost. Until next time. Good luck, Kareem. Exactly. <laughs>